Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Gotta make sure my volume is... Well, fuck it. Anyways, I'm gonna start doing my February readings and I um, did like a random card pull. So I have the lineup and the first one I'm gonna start with is Aries. So, with that being said, I'm gonna do it um, Aries, but I wanted to say, uh, welcome to all the new subscribers. Um, welcome to the channel. Uh, welcome back to all the oldies but goodies, you know what I'm saying? Um, I appreciate all the likes, comments. Um, check the description box with ways to contact me if you want to do your own personal readings. I don't remember what else I was going to say. Okay. So, what are the... What is the messages for the sign of Aries... For February of 2018. I did some shuffling off camera. <gasps> I know. I'm gonna go to hell. But uh I hate when people shuffle forever on just channels. Hold on. Let's switch this view so you don't have to see my crap in the background. You can just see my white trash beautiful self today. Look at my hair. Anyways, what are the messages for the sign of Aries? You can't say that I'm not fucking raw and real, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, <laughs> all these bitches are, like, super made up with makeup and they've got, like, this, you know, fuck it. Fuck it. It's real and it's raw, you know what I'm saying? So I like my stuff. That sounded dirty, but it is what it is, okay? Tell me how a bitch end up with four kids, but we'll keep... <clears throat> Anyways... What are the messages for the sign of Aries for February of 2018? Ready or not? I think you guys are ready. You're ready. So, Page of Swords in reverse. Nine of Swords. Seven of Cups in reverse. Eight of Swords in reverse. Shit. Queen of Swords in reverse. Ace of Cups. King of Swords. Nine of Wands in reverse. Queen of Pentacles. Bottom of the deck is a Two of Wands. So, waiting for results, possibly. Planning on seeing one, are we, Aries? Are we um, stressing out a little bit about money? Maybe you're trying to go see someone, but you don't have any money to do it right now. But things are going to move forward. And you're dealing with the devil. <laughs> Just kidding. <coughs> okay. <coughs> the devil card does represent... Uh, Capricorn, but it also represents some type of uh, addictions or um, an addiction, addicting person, possibly a s sexual. I don't know. You have three major arcanas back to back, so you're definitely dealing with destiny and a fucking soulmate. You know what I'm saying? So I think you're addicted to sex <laughs> with your person. It is what it is. I'd go on to go see them too. Better save up. You know what I'm saying? Pack your whole bag. Um, moving on to the table. You have the Page of Swords in reverse. So the Page of Swords in reverse is kind of a douche. Page of Swords is... Um, the best way to put it is that it's kind of some bad news. But the Page of Swords are like, any of the sword people are, are quick, okay? Sometimes they're in and out. When they're in the reverse, they're really in and out. But this could be, I feel like you, is it your kid? Are you guys dealing with a kid? Because you have the Page of Swords in reverse, you have the Queen of Swords in reverse, and then you have the King of Swords. So either someone's fucking arguing, or this is like your, this is your family, 
or this is your unit. But you do have a lot of swords on the table. You might be dealing with the air sign. But I feel like this is your family. Um, then you're not talking very nicely to each other. Possibly arguing. Speaking the truth a little bit about some shit. To your mom. You're in love with somebody. So maybe you guys, maybe you're arguing with your family about who you love. You know, families are overprotective. A little bit, a little bit. Um, so, Page of Swords is kind of some bad news. So maybe you're in your head about it, because then you have the Nine of Swords. But there's going to be clarity about this, okay? There'll be clarity about whatever bad news you receive. The next line is the Eight of Swords in Reverse. So, release of... maybe escaping something but there's freedom freedom from this shit that was going on in your head and then you have the queen of stars in reverse who doesn't take any bullshit and she's kind of a bitch someone who kind of lies sometimes and she's really cold and she uh, her words bite and they bite hard and they bite deep But maybe you're releasing yourself from this person because you want to offer your love to someone or someone wants to offer their love to you. Maybe it's a water sign. But there's something new coming in. Um, baby relationship proposal. Are you going to propose to somebody? <laughs> Are you arguing with your family because you're about to marry a chick that they don't like? A dude your family doesn't like? Or maybe you got pregnant by the wrong one. <laughs> and your family's like, Maldivia. King of Swords is kind of intentional. He knows what the fuck he wants. He goes in and gets it. And he doesn't stop for nothing. I feel like you're going to speak your truth about this. And you're going to go for what you want. Because you're going to be coming out of the isolation and paranoia. And you are going to get what you want. And maybe it's with a this Queen of Pentacles who is motherly and shit, good with her money, grounded, down to earth, queen of king, somebody you love, somebody that other people don't seem to like in your life, or maybe you're arguing with somebody that you love, but you're still going to continue on your your way because you received some bad news but you're going to be releasing from that so you're still going going to go and speak your truth and do what you want to do go for what you want the nine of swords is kind of worry fear anxiety Grief, depression in your head. Someone is uh, making you feel this way. Maybe this person that's not being very nice to you. But you are going to stop isolating from that period of... Maybe you're just not dealing with it right now. Like there's some shit going on and you haven't really dealt with it. Because you are in your head and you're arguing with someone, it looks like. The Seven of Cups this way is having too many choices and commitment issues. I don't feel like that's you anymore. I feel like you're at this, so you know what you want. And you're going to offer it to someone that you love. And that is this queen. Maybe someone's pregnant.
but I feel like it's still someone that you love. But there's a whole lot of air on this table. And either you're dealing with an air sign or you are fighting with yourself or other people. They might be outside people, outside your situation, but still influential. Still kind of a, ends with you speaking your truth about something, I think being very intentional now. Maybe you weren't in the past. Maybe you were really unsure. You have the Five of Pentacles in reverse that came out. This talks about a new job or a new home. Whew, excuse me. Hope returning. Recovering. Maybe with this earth sign. Chick. What is the advice for the sign of Aries for February of 2018? Six of swords in reverse. So you're unable to move on from something right now. But I feel like it's in your head. Seven of swords. No, seven of wands. Maybe you feel like just walking away. You don't really want to fight for this. This person is, though. This dude has, like, six wands pointed at him, and he's got his over his head, like, let's do this. So maybe you're kind of feeling self-defensive about someone in your life. And you are fighting for it. What is this sign? What is the sign? <laughs> what is the advice for the sign of Aries for February 2018? <laughs> Nine of Wands in reverse. Talking about this isolation ending. I think it's you really just I think you do need to speak your truth a little bit. Move towards what you want to move towards. Because you're feeling lost or maybe you're worried about losing something because you have some adversity. These two cards came out again, so... Speak your truth to this person, or maybe this is who you're going for, but I don't know. There was someone who didn't know what they wanted. There was commitment issues. There's still this new... Are you moving in with someone? Page of Pentacles is a... Um, message about a new job or raise. So you guys are getting some money, I think. Or a new house. Maybe you're going to get a new house. But you were struggling with it in the past. But maybe when you come into this power and you speak your truth and you go for it, things will work out. That's all I have for you lovely people. Have a good night.